This is section 1.1, which is about what is business statistics. So we will talk about business statistics, inshallah. Now, uh, this is the definition, a collection. Business statistics is a collection of uh, procedures and techniques that are used to convert data into meaningful information in a business environment. So we will have a data, there will be data collected. But then how to convert this data into meaningful information? Then we graph it, we find the average, we find uh, the median, we, uh, we use it uh, to predict other information. So this is the business statistics. So we will study in this section these procedures and these techniques that will enable us to convert data into meaningful information. There are two kinds of uh, statistics. There are two categories. The first category is the descriptive statistics. Okay, involves the procedure and techniques designed to describe data, like graphs, charts, numerical measurements or measures. Second category, tools and techniques that help decision makers draw inferences from a set of data. So this is the inferential uh, statistics. The first part, descriptive statistics. We will talk only today about these two types. Descriptive statistics, you uh, describe the data. For example, you have data like this, okay? And you describe this data either by charts, graphs, okay, like histogram. This is called the histogram. Uh, we use it for continuous data here under 50,000, but then 50,000 to 100,000. We need a number of books, but this is a histogram. The bars are connected, and the data are continuous. And we can also make a bar chart for categories when we have discrete data and the data is not continuous like مثلا, here business social science for there are two categories we need a number of total of copies sold we need a total of copies sold so you have two bars had a horizontal this is horizontal bar chart we can graph a vertical bar chart okay uh, if the bars are vertical, we call it vertical. If the bars are horizontal, we call it horizontal bar chart. The bars are not connected, not like the histogram. So this is the descriptive statistic. You use graphs uh, to describe data. You describe data using numerical measures. You say, for example, that the average uh, score of the students in the first quiz is seven. You are describing the data. So this is descriptive statistic. The second part of statistic is inferential statistic. We use inferential procedures. Fahina procedures that allow a decision maker to reach a conclusion about a set of data based on a subset of that data. In this set of data here, population. This is the population. Fahina, we choose a sample subset and uh, we find a numerical measure from the sample for example we find the average of the sample and we use the average of the sample to predict the average of the population this is inferential statistic so we can we, we reach a conclusion about the average of the population using the average of the sample there are two kinds of inferential statistic the first one estimation we will study this in chapter 8, inshallah, we estimate the average of the population using the average of the sample. Okay, this is estimation. And there is also hypothesis testing. And we will study this in stat 27271 or 272, not in this course, uh, in chapter 9 and, and 10, hypothesis testing. Uh, let us take just one example. Uh, and it is the only example we need in section 1.1, which is 1.1. For the following situation, indicate whether the statistical 
application is primarily descriptive or inferential. And here, I'll give you a situation. And you tell me this situation, uh, how can you describe? Is it a descriptive statistic or inferential statistic? If you read, the manager of Anne's fabric shop has collected data for 10 years on the quality, on the quantity of each type of dress fabric. Then I have data which is collected for 10 years about uh, the type of dress fabric, okay, and has been sold, that has been sold at the store. If I need data collected, and she is interested, the manager here, Anne, Anna's, uh, Anna, she is interested in making a presentation that will illustrate this data effectively. For she needs to present, to make a presentation, to describe or illustrate the data. For to illustrate the data or describe the data, she will use graphs, she will use, uh, she will find the average, the, and she will describe the data to make a presentation. There is no prediction here. She is not going to predict anything about the population. She only will present the data. For in fact, uh, this situation is about descriptive statistic. Uh, this is the end of section 1.1. I'll stop the recording now and uh, I receive all of your